There's a study that involves two rats. One of them is on a wheel that it controls. The, right. the rat can run whenever it wants to run. There's, that's rat A. Rat B is on another wheel, but rat B's wheel is hooked up to rat A's wheel. Rat B doesn't get to decide. Rat A, whenever that rat runs, rat B's wheel moves mm. and rat B has to run. They're both doing the exact same amount of exercise. The results of the experiment are that rat A, the, all the positive markers associated with exercise. Rat B has all of the negative markers associated with stress. They're both running the exact same amount. They're not doing, one's not doing more exercise than the other, but one is choosing and the other one is having to. When we start to think that we're no longer choosing, when we're now having to do something, we used to be rat A, but now, because it made money and with that money, we went and bought a house and we got an expensive mortgage and we got the car and we did this and we did that, or we just had the expectation now because our identity is built on earning that much money. So it might not even be the stuff that's weighing you down. It's your identity that's weighing you down and the perception you want other people to have of you or retain of you. That now has turned you into rat B. You're no longer choosing this thing. 